planner friends. It's Amber from Amber Plans Our Day, and I'm super excited to come on and share with you everything that I'll be packing for Go Wild Dallas this year. This is going to be all planning supplies in this video, so there's not going to be like any um, clothing or anything like that, but I just wanted to share with you to help you out some of the planner supplies that maybe you would consider bringing with you for the trip and Spoiler alert, it's not a lot, like at all. So I just wanted to come on and share that with you. I am going to be bringing this Happy Planner bag. It's pink and pink's not my favorite color, but it definitely goes with Go Wild and the theme. So everything is going to literally fit in here. This is what I'm bringing. I'll leave this in my tote bag so that everywhere I go, I'll have whatever planner supplies I need. Now, I am debating bringing these two sticker books, the chances of me needing them or using them are pretty slim. Um, but I am considering it just because it is nice to have like a colorful box if I want to take a note of something. So we'll see. They should fit in here either way. Um, I might, I guess I might not bring Go Wild Memories or maybe I'll rip out a couple of pages because I don't really think I would need this stuff. Like, if anything, it would just be functional stuff. So I think I'll probably just bring this. Then, of course, we need our badge. So this was last year's in Washington, D.C. So let me grab this year's. So I have two pins on here already. Go Wild Dallas 2024 and Wild in Dallas. So uh, these are the same. So this is going to be the same Go Wild Washington, D.C. 2023. I wonder if people like put this on so that they could see what Go Wilds people have been to. I don't know if I'll put it on yet. What do you guys think? Um, but all otherwise, all of these are pretty specific for Washington, D.C., Law Mistake, D.C., We the Planners. Um, second Go Wild is definitely special to last year so I probably won't put any of these on there I might put the balloons though because they're cute um and Dory my friend gave it to me um also the llama love pin is just adorable and I will be having these as freebies I have like 50 pins left some of them are these ones and then some of them are these so I have about 50 that I'm going to be giving away for free so if you want one come find me but from my badge last year, I have this that JoJo gave me as a way to keep my hotel room key safe while I am walking around because she apparently knows me very well that I am not a very safe person. So I do not know, geez, how I'm actually going to get this out with the nails though. So I don't know if I'll be able to use it, but I'm going to... Put it on here just in case um, and I'll probably take the stickers off and then if I can get the, this open, I can at least leave it open, um, then I can have that um, for my hotel room key. I am going to put on a new Llama Love pin just so that I can have one for each year instead of, you know, swapping it over. So we're going to have, maybe we could put it right here and the badge is good to go. I debated bringing the full badge box, but I just feel like I don't want to waste that space. So I'm going to be not bringing the badge box. Instead, I'm going to be bringing all of that planner stuff in that pink bag. So I'll save the badge box so that I can make sure I have everything I need for um, storing it after Go Wild. But we have this. Don't need that anymore. And we have this. Um, and then the number one thing I definitely want to bring is this plum paper journal that I got because I've been using it for all of the things that I need to keep track of. And I can always like put different stickers in here to write on. So that is definitely coming in here. 
I'll probably just bring these pip sticks because they're cute. If I want to use one, I can and I'll have it. Definitely need to bring my post secret. I did share a secret last year and that was very fun. Um, and then this is just some Live Love Posh stuff. This one says that you need to bring it to redeem swag. So I definitely want to bring both of those. This is just going to be helpful information, kind of the itinerary, um, different things that are going on, some tips. So I definitely want to make sure I pack this as well. Of course, I'm going to bring the sticker party bracelet. And I'll probably just bring these stickers as well because I have plenty of space in here and I'm not too worried about that. Um, I probably will bring the washi cutter, but I'm going to put it into this Join Pro bag. I don't even remember where I got this, when I got this, but it's Go Wild Colors. It's super cute and it like holds everything. So the first thing I'm going to put over here are all of my writing pens. So I have a Rytec 0.5. This is one of my favorite 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 writing pens. Then I also have a Zebra Sarasa Clip pen, one of my favorites. Um, this is the Zebra Flight. So just different pens I can use to write. This is the Zebra Z Grip. And those are going to be all of the pens that I pack. But I'll put this in there. And I'll put the washi from Once More With Love in this as well so then I can have that then on the other side of here we're gonna put um mild liners love 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 mild liners this is the um neutral pack love the neutrals but I also want to grab mild liners in I forgot this pen too because this is the pen that Zebra gave us. I'm gonna put it over here. In case I want a colored pen for any reason. I'm mostly a black pen girly, but that's okay. Um, so then I also wanna grab mild liners in the color scheme um, of Go Wild this year. There is a yellow in Go Wild this year. So that's very fun and exciting. Some of these are the brush pens. I don't know where my mild liner cups went, but I think I'm going to pack these three colors. The only color that I would have added to this is a purple, but I don't know where it went. So I'm just not going to spend too much time wondering and thinking about it. So I'm just going to put those in there. And this other stuff, I think I'm just going to leave loose in there. In this container or yeah in this little zipper thing um part of me wants to do something with this small stuff but it's too big for this um I guess we'll just put it in there the main reason is because I definitely want my journal look at this it fits in there perfect I want my journal to make sure it's like kind of at the top so that it fits really nicely in there. I probably should put a couple more things in my journal before we go. And then I need to put on the balloon pin that I was talking about. Forgot that. Um, I guess I need to figure out why this is backwards. If you guys have pins too, I'd love any other ones. I don't know how we're gonna, I guess we're just going like that. I don't know. Um, and then let's put this in here. This is just gonna be so helpful. All I have to do is grab this bag, which is so helpful. And then let's do a couple other things in here before we go as well. I'm going to open up both sides of this so that we can make sure I have everything. We're going to finish the packing list first. Um, I definitely need, okay, travel aids. I'm going to do my iPad. 
we're gonna do headphones, travel charger, um, clothes. Oh my gosh, I'm so stressed out. I definitely want to pack shorts because I think that the weather is gonna be nice. Jeans, shorts, jeans, tops, dresses, because I love wearing dresses. I need to spell dressed, which I mean is accurate, but not what I needed to write. Dresses, okay. Um, Of course I need like underwear. Undies and socks. Put pajamas. I'm actually gonna write also just regular pajamas because I'm not gonna sleep in the plain jamma clothes. Um, the basics. I don't know what to put there. Miscellaneous. I don't know. Um. Oh, travel details. We can put this. Transportation reservation departure information. Departure at three. 20 p.m. Oh, what time is arrival at? 6? 6, 6.30? 6 6.30 p.m.? The time difference. It's like makes it look so much more than it is, but it's really not. Um, Colorado Springs. Airports. Okay. The transportation is going to be an Uber. And then um, we're going to be flying southwest. I think that's meant to be like air travel, but I don't know. I don't know. Transportation, we're probably going to Uber back to the airport, but we're also taking southwest. And we are flying in or flying back home so early. We have to leave our, the hotel at four in the morning, which is like beyond crazy. Dallas. Love airports. Um, departure. I want to say it's like at 6 a.m. It probably is like at 6 a.m. 6 a.m. We arrive at like 9.20 a.m. Accommodations. That was all JoJo's job. Out and about. I cannot wait to go eat places. I think that I'm going to call this good too. I need to keep this out so I can pack. But other than that... I'm pretty good with that. Um, okay, so then let's put both of these in here as well. This, and then this might be a little bit of a tight fit. I wonder if I should have put that first. Oh no, it fits okay. It makes it a little bit fat, a little bit wide, but it's not bad. Um, it'll like fit in my tote bag for sure. And at least everything's like contained in here. Um, and then if I really don't love that, I can just keep this out because at least everything's in here. And then it's like two separate things, but I think I'm going to keep it together for now. Okay, perfect. I think I have everything I need for planning um, while in Dallas. I don't really bring a lot of things just like my favorite pens and a couple of stickers and different things like that, my journal, just so that I am fully prepared for really just it being in the experience versus like planning. It's not really like a, we're all gonna sit down and plan together event. It's kind of a journal, take notes, hang out kind of thing. So I hope that this was helpful for you guys to know how to pack for Go Wild. If you guys enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up, hit that subscribe button so don't miss any future videos of mine, and I'll see you next time. Bye.